Come on, I just want to land inside of your nose or whatever this is. Oh, where are you going? Where are you going? Oh, he just came up. Hey! Wait, are we in him? Uh, oh boy. All right, let's go ahead and start trying to light him up here. All right, we are locked on to. Uh, those are missiles coming. Oh. Oops. Hello, YouTube Komodo Gaming here, bringing you guys another episode of Simple Planes. And yes, folks, we are back once again, and we have a bit of business to do. Now, last episode, if you recall, uh, we found the Kraken, and I attempted to get inside of the Kraken, and I failed miserably. But, I have some new planes here today. Uh, that's going to be one of the things that we're going to attempt here today. I've got several other things. Uh, some people were pointing out uh, that there's quite a few islands that are not... Uh, like visible from the mainland uh, that you start at uh, that are pretty cool So we might go discover some of those check out some cool creations But anyways folks if you're enjoying simple planes on the channel Maybe hit that thumbs up button if you have any suggestions for future episodes comment below, but yeah, let's jump right into this All right, so we got a new helicopter here. This is called the black mamba. This thing is actually really really cool now it is carrying a new mod the mod is available on the workshop or the simple planes website it's a uh, instrumentation mod, so we actually have stuff for the dash here. This is really, really cool looking. But yeah, I figured uh, a lot of people were saying this is going to be the easiest way to try to get inside of the Kraken. I must say this is a... Maybe it's a little too big of a helicopter. I, I don't know. I think this actually is going to work. So I'm going to go ahead over to the Kraken. I have a spawn point that's pretty close to it. I uh, probably could stick one even closer. But yeah, we're going to do that. Uh, this thing, let's go ahead and start pushing forward. Yeah, this thing actually handles really nice. I must say I'm rather impressed by this helicopter. Uh, that's been one thing that we have never really checked out in Simple Planes. Uh, I've always kind of ignored them, and I'm not really sure why. Uh, these things can be used for a lot of stuff, especially getting inside of a Kraken. At least I hope so. All right, we got a target in sight. The Kraken is just below us. I'm kind of surprised the sky hasn't changed yet. I wonder if we're uh, a little too high here. Now his, uh, you can see my mouse pointer here. His head, his eyes, or whatever the openings are, are going to be on this side. So as long as we can avoid the tentacles, I think we'll be fine. Uh, we're going to start letting off here, kind of losing some power. And we're going to try to get down. We're going to ease our way down to him. I'm trying to figure out where do I want the camera to be during this whole thing. We might actually go cockpit. I don't know. All right, let's go ahead and get down to him. Uh, let's go ahead and just lose altitude. Still getting a little bit used to the plane controls. They are quite nice. Uh, the, at least the planes really, or the helicopter's really stable, so... Uh-oh. Just completely killed it there. Alright, come on. I'm gonna get down there. Alright, it has gotten dark. It's like we're almost coming in on a stealth approach. We're so dark. Uh, no. I see a Komodo jet. What are you doing? Uh, I've already despawned those. Uh, I'm gonna have to despawn them again. Uh, the AI gets a little bit uh, aggressive, and I feel like I'm kind of uh, here in the open to get hit by a plane. I'm kind of hoping that doesn't happen. But anyways, uh, we're kind of on a slow approach here. Uh, we will eventually get around to it. Uh, let's go ahead and pitch the nose down a little further and try to pick up some speed here. Oh, okay, Kraken is awake. All right, I see the openings that I need to get to. Oh, I don't like this thing. But I feel like this is... Wait, where are you going? Wait. Okay, come back up. All right, it just lit up red. What the heck? I don't get it. Okay, no, he's coming back. Okay, <laughs> he can't make up his mind today. Uh, I need you to turn this way, buddy. Oh, this is going to be... I'm going to need to be really careful. What I need to do, I need to get really close to him on the, uh, on the side here because I can't move fast. And those tentacles... Uh, yeah, they are way faster than this helicopter currently is. Uh, but if I can get down there, I feel pretty confident that I can get inside of the eye hole. Or whatever it is. I'm actually seeing a lot of light coming from the back side of him. Does he have eye holes and stuff on each side? Uh, possibly. Alright, come here, you ugly thing. Oh, no, 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 no. Don't hit me. Don't hit me. I'm not down for that. Uh, we're getting close, folks. I'm just taking my time here. I don't want to rush in. Uh, because when he makes turns like that, 
Uh, that can easily catch us on one of the walls. I'm not going to actually try to rush in until I get to the opening. Because uh, he's moving quite a bit. Oh, don't move this way, buddy. Oh, yeah. We're going to do this today. This is going to be awesome. We're going to see what's inside of here. And I just thought, what if we're actually going into, like, his nose hole? And this is just, like, boogers or something. That'd be kind of weird. Oh, 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 oh. Okay, okay. We're here. We're here. Wait. Are we on the wrong side? I, I can't see the red. Uh, oh, pick up some altitude. Uh, where are you going? No, don't, don't turn that way. I need you over here. Oh, he's going to turn back here in a second and knock me down, isn't he? All right, buddy. Oh, no, 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 no. Okay, here we go. Let's go ahead, turn the helicopter. Let's get in the camera. Oh, we can see inside of it. Okay, this is the camera I want. Okay, we're at the hole. Okay, let's go ahead and kick some speed back in. Oh, I think our helicopter might be a little too big. I'm not sure. <laughs> oh, no, 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 no. Okay. Oh, I think the blades were too big on the helicopter to get in. Uh, there's a spot there. Oh, don't turn. Come on, I just want to land inside of your nose or whatever this is. Oh, where are you going? Where are you going? Come here, Kraken. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Okay, let's turn. Oh, we are so close. Okay. Oh, no, he's moving again. He's moving. Oh, kill it. Kill it. Okay, bandit. All right, let's, uh, let's go back this way. Let's do a spin. Oh, buddy. Oh, there it is. There's opening. <gasps> okay, come on. Come on. No, 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 no. No. Oops. Oh, he didn't like that. Oops. Huh. All right. Maybe we need to go with something a little smaller. All right. We're back here at the Kraken. He came up and then he came back. He went down and then he went back into his normal state. Uh, we're here. Hello. Hello, Kraken. Uh, do I need to bounce into you to make you active? I mean, we're right here. Um, what are you doing? Okay, what happens if I land on top of you? Uh, he seems to have gone back down for some reason. I'm not really understanding this. Like, normally he stays up, and he came up for a little bit, and he went down into hiding. Uh, maybe he's caught on to what we're trying to do here. Hold on, we're gonna land on top of him real quick. You know, his head isn't near as flat as it looks. I don't know if there's a good spot to land at here. Uh, let's come down... Uh, looking for it. Maybe right here. We'll try landing it right here. Oh, uh, I have a feeling this is going to be bad. Uh, wait, what? Oh, we just bounced off his surface. His skin or check texture changes. That's really weird. Uh-oh. Oops. All right, well, we're going to have to do emergency landing on him. I don't know. It's weird when you get close to him. I've never seen something like that. Oh, he just came up. Hey. Wait, are we in him? Um, oh, we're in him. How did we just, well, wait, how did we just do this? We actually, he went up again, finally, and we just landed in him. Huh. Okay. Is there multiple holes? Uh, is that, there's a hole there. There's a hole over there. There is. There's holes on each side. Those holes are a little low. Uh, well, this is inside of the Kraken. Uh, we made it. I planned on landing in here, but we actually... He came back up and we morphed through his head or the top of him. You know, I was kind of hoping there was something else in here. Uh, this just looks like a bunch of... I don't know if these are boogers or what this is. Too bad we couldn't get out and uh, walk around. Actually, you know what? We can save in here. I think. I don't know if this works. Uh, let's try saving this right here. Ooh! That's what happens when we go to restart inside of him. Oh, what the heck is happening here? Oh. <laughs> All right, so we have a spawn point inside of him now, but it, yeah, it doesn't quite work because we morph up in his head. Yeah, you know, there's not really anything in here. I kind of expected like there to be something in the center of it. We're kind of floating along here, uh, doing a little bit of exploring, but yeah, he's got these things that hang down. It's just like a creepy cave and the whispering and the red lights. Uh, that's actually really cool, though. I, I like this. Uh, 
you know, I don't. I wanted to have a spawn point in here because I wanted to land in here, but the way he moves, this is what happens at the beginning, and it's water. Hmm. I don't wonder if maybe we could spawn. Now, let me save one more. Maybe we can spawn a boat in here. Okay, we're gonna try to spawn this seaplane in here, so we should float and we should be able to take off on the inside. And, oh, no, that's not the one I want. Uh, let's go ahead and go locations. I've got one that's actually inside of them. You can see I have a lot of save points here. This is somebody who was like, hey, you need to be saving all of these. And why did it not save the other inside one? Huh? That's weird. All right. So we just respawned inside of the Kraken. I think we have broken simple planes because technically we are on the inside. This is the spawn point. <laughs> Yeah, we broke the game because there's the tentacles. Uh, we're where its head's supposed to be. What happens if we try to move here? Uh, come on. I'm waiting for him to pop up here. It's really cool. It's a, a nice little thing in the game that you can get inside of. I was kind of expecting there to be like another secret or something. Uh, but still pretty neat. Uh, we're probably going to move on to uh, going and checking out some of the other islands. But this is something... Oh, there he goes! There. He Wait, what? Am I... Am I in them? Oh, that, there's another view of it. Yeah, there's nothing, uh, no secrets. Uh, oh! <laughs> ah, there we go. Ah, that's still cool, though. Anyways, I think it is time to go discover some more islands. All right, so we've got a snow island we need to get to. I think it's called Snowstone, and it's pretty, uh, I think it's a direct approach from the Jaeger Airport. Uh, you just kind of go straight from its final approach area. So we're going to be taking out this uh, sweet looking jet here called the uh, H377 Griffin. I don't know if I've ever heard of this. Is this a real life jet? Uh, this is actually a really nice looking jet. And look at what it's equipped with. They got rockets, bombs. Uh, very, very nice. So we're going to spawn this and we're going to go discover the little snow island. Which I'm hoping there's a landing spot there. If not, we'll save the location. That way we can travel over there in the future. All right, here we are. We are in the jet. Uh, we are on the final approach. I think it's called the Jaeger uh, Airport. And supposedly, we just have to go straight up. I'm assuming, yeah, this is almost straight north. Uh, this might take a little bit. You know, the Kraken is actually, I think we're going to cross paths where the Kraken is. Uh, normally, you want to go about in that direction uh, from the Bandit Airport's final approach to find the Kraken. Uh, but supposedly we want to go just straight forward here. Uh, while we're at it, we're going to test out this plane a little bit and check and see what it's got here. This is nice. I really, really like this. Uh, we might have to do a little bit of battling with this thing. Pretty nimble. Uh, does it have a cockpit? Eh, it kind of does. I don't know. I'm going to get spoiled with that instrumentation mod because those make the interiors look so awesome. All right, I've got a uh, visual on an island, which I'm... That looks pretty white. Okay, is this the actual island, though? I don't think it is. Could be, hon. Huh? There's something over here to the left. Okay, there's some islands of... Oh! Oh, there it is. Okay, the Kraken would be over there. Uh, let's take a turn. Now, I've been advised to watch out on this island. I think there is some sort of almost like SAM turret or something. Uh, that somebody will shoot missiles at you. So, we need to get to like a good location on the island. And either it becomes a, a permanent point or I need to add one. And that is... That is so glorious looking. Wow! You know, it's so surprising. I've played this game quite a bit. I didn't know about these little secrets until, uh, <laughs> just really about a week ago. There we go. We just discovered the Avalanche Airport. Where's the actual airport at? I don't know. This is, actually, I think I see it possibly up there to the uh, top left. Looks like a base or something. Man, we might have to grab some vehicles for this island. This, uh, uh-oh. 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 Counter. Counter. Where's it coming from? Oh, it's coming from the base. Oh, let's see if we can drop down here in the, uh, oh, come on. Get down in the glaciers. Or I don't know what these are. Just get down in the canyons. Uh, we got to stay out of sight of that turret. Oh boy. Okay, let's just get down here. All right, we're good. We're good. I think we're fast enough to get away from any missiles. Uh, we should be out of its targeting range now. Okay, so we are discovering a whole bunch of things here. There's going to be a lot of spawn points. Uh-oh. Uh, come on. Come on. No, 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 no,
Island. Oh, I hope the rocket's not behind us. Oh, okay. This is some low level flying here. There's something over to the right. Is that? No, maybe it's just something in the water. This is a lot bigger than I expected. Like, I did not expect to see something this big island wise. I mean, the Kraken was surprising enough, but this is actually fairly impressive. All right, now question is, it says I unlocked an airport. Is that airport where the missiles are coming from or what? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Uh, folks, I was not paying attention to my fuel. Uh, we have ran out of fuel here. Uh, oh boy. Okay, we're gonna make an emergency landing on the tundra here, if we can make it down to it. Uh, let's go ahead and deploy landing gear. We are losing speed fast. I probably should have waited on those because I'm sure those probably affect my aerodynamics a bit. And my gliding capabilities. Oh boy. Oh no. Okay, we might be going for water landing here. Pull up, pull up. Put the landing gear up. Oh, oh, are we gonna, do we sink? Yeah, we're gonna sink. I thought maybe we could uh, get it back up here. Well, I guess this is a good chance to go ahead and uh, play around with the island a bit. Now it says it's got a new location here, so we have the Avalanche Airport. Isn't this where I got shot from? All right, I am a bit suspicious of this airport. I could swear this is where I got shot from. Uh, the question is, where's the actual missile turret at? Oh, 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 that was a janky uh, takeoff. Yeah, this, no, this isn't where I got shot from. I got shot from up at the top of the island. There must be another base or something over there. I wonder if it's something, is it something we can take out? Let's go to air to ground mode and see if we can locate that. All right, I'm getting a somewhat of a lock on what appears to be some ground targets. I am in a very bad position to take these out though. I really wish I was on the back side of the island. I would swoop over. Uh, oh boy. All right, let's go ahead and start trying to light them up here. All right, we are locked on to. Uh, those are missiles coming! Oh. Oops. Hey, we got another location here. I am not good at avoiding those. I'm assuming those are somewhat heat-seeking. Uh, some of these have countermeasures on them, but I think a lot of it comes down to flying. Hey, guys. There's a, uh, there's an opening here at the base of the mountain. What does that lead into? Is there a secret opening? Is there a way? Is there, like, a cave in here? Man, I think we need to grab a small boat and see, is there a way up this river? Uh, question is, do you get shot when you're in this river by the missiles? I don't know, I see an opening here. I'm assuming that leads out somewhere. All right, let's uh, see if we can get something over here. All right, so we have another plane here. This is called the Hypernaut Gans, I believe is the name. Uh, we're gonna try to outrun those missiles. I need to plant some spawn points over here. And oh, this thing maneuvers like a champ. It's got guns on it. Doesn't appear to have any missiles on it, but we're not here to attack the base uh, quite yet. So let's go ahead. We're going to provoke it a bit. I'm looking at the water layout here and trying to see if I can get a boat here somewhere. Okay, so the opening. Oh, that is a tight. Oh, that is really tight. I uh, got some missiles coming at us. We're behind the thing here. We're good. Okay, there's the base. Okay, so is there anything on the back side of this island that would uh, help us in this situation? Don't believe so. Uh, not seeing anything. Dang, that is a tight waterway. You'd have to have an extremely small boat to get down to the base of the mountain. Okay, about to fly over the base, uh, kind of provoke it a little bit. Looking at the waterway. Okay, there's another opening here, waterway-wise. Uh, there's some rocks here, and you're exposed to the base, but if you had a small enough craft, you should be able to get through here. Right, we're locked on to, waiting, waiting, waiting. Okay, it's lift. Uh, oh, there we go. Avoided that one. Oh, uh oh, uh oh, oh. That's not good. Oh, no, 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 no. We're in a spin. We're in a spin. Oh, <laughs> Okay, well that answered our question though. There is a waterway that goes all the way out. We need to be over here, which we might actually land in a decent spawn point. Huh? Let's see what happens when we bounce off the mountain. If we land in the water, we might be able to get a, a boat down here and head down. Oh, don't don't go up. Oh, come on, bounce back in the water. Give us a spawn point down here. Oh, uh, buddy. Yeah, we're still really close, but I think if we get a boat, we can hug up against the mountain. We should be fine. Yeah. 
That's pretty close for a spawn point. Alright, so we are in a little PT boat, and I think... As long as we stay hugged up to this mountain in front of us here and through this little river, this little snaking river, I think we'll be out of range of the missiles from the base. So we are going to go to the base of the base, I guess I should say, and we're going to see what that little opening is. I want to say it's just a dock, but if I can make that a spawn point, we will be right under their noses. You know, I have a little bit of fear once we get around this little corner here, we are going to be exposed to that base. Uh, oh boy. I did not think about that. Okay, let's see. Let's keep an eye out for it. Oh, no. There's the base right up there. Okay. This is going to be the moment of truth. I'm going to have to get through this little area right up here. If I can get through it without those missiles targeting me, uh, I'll be good. I think I'm low enough, but uh, you never know with how those are. Oh, no, that's going to put us right in the direct path of it. Oh boy, I hope this boat's fast enough. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. No! Oh. 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 I guess they're, uh, I guess they're blowing us back. Oh boy. I don't know. I don't know how we're gonna get there. Ah. Alright, I've got one more plan. All right, I've got another plan here. What we're gonna do, we're just gonna get close enough to that opening and we'll go down right beside it. I'm gonna approach from the opposite side island-wise, so I shouldn't really encounter too many missiles. And if I do, I'll be so close to the uh, the mountain, I think I'll be fine. But I think this is gonna be the best way to be able to get that little location down below the base. Uh, here we go, here we go. Oh, I was so tense. I didn't even talk during that. I was, uh, I didn't actually get spotted till the last moment. But here we are. We're at the opening. So I'm going to make this a location. And then we're going to go into here. I'm pretty sure it's going to be nothing in here, but we'll see. All right. Here we are. We are at the, uh, docks. Oh, boy. Yep. Right under their noses. They can't even hit us down here. That's awesome. Uh, if I can get this PT boat turned around, we'll be good to go. And we will drive in there. Which I have a feeling there's going to be a bunch of nothing in there, but still, I want to say that we were able to do this. Oh, I'm not able to turn much in this right now. Uh, come on. Okay, we know we're going to have to go backwards. Alright, here we go. Question is, what is inside of this dock? Oh, hey. I hope there's not a missile in here. Oh, that would be funny. Uh, uh, yep, it's a bunch of... Pretty much nothing, I think. Huh. Well, it keeps going. What is this place? So, we could spawn like a battleship or something down here. It'd be really pointless. And wait a minute. Wait, is that a wall or is that a... Does that go down from here? Uh, nope. That appears to be a wall. Well, we have made it inside the not-so-secret base thingy now. That is pretty cool. I still want to take out the top side of that base, though. Those missiles get on my nerves a bit. But anyways, we're probably going to wrap up the episode here today, folks. If you have any other suggestions for future episodes, comment below. If anybody knows how to take out that base above us, also let me know. Uh, we'll probably go and discover some more islands uh, next episode. I didn't realize this island was truly this big. Uh, so we did a, quite a bit of exploring here today. But yeah, if you want to check out any of the creations, they're linked down in the description. Uh, if you'd like to like and subscribe, everything helps my channel. And we will see you guys next time in Simple Planes. Thank you.